Hey guys, what is up? Hope everyone is doing well. Hope everyone's having an amazing day because I am as usual. And ladies and gentlemen, we are back with some interesting posts, some big statements from some investors. So it's important that we dive deep into this and actually see what is going on, what the individual people are doing and how everyone is feeling about it, okay? So someone put up saying, I feel very dumb. I have been hoarding 3.5K worth of SHIB until it's 600 now, but I'm currently, uh, I, I currently hold just because I can't quit after all the time and the money I spent. People will say at least get whatever you have left, but it's either I'm stupid or lazy, I have no clue. So a very honest, interesting, sincere uh, statement. And I think we should look at what other people have to say about it. And then perhaps, you know, I will analyze it as well. You're not alone. Hold your future self, uh, self says thank you. People who are down need to look at all crypto. Almost every crypto is down over the past, over 75 percent past year i was up a thousand percent now back to even i'm still buying getting more bone i have 500 bone now over 5k bone once your bone uh, does go in economy get better i'm sure it'll uh, be a thousand percent plus again don't sell a loss unless you need the dollars now also check bitcoin and how it was up and when it came out until one day it's one thousand percent itself that's all cool story but what you forget to mention is that nobody no bloody one can will guarantee they that any uh, shit coin or any token will ever reach its all-time high or get the same attention after bear. Even big boy cryptos die off in bear. What's another $600 loss? If you're already down 2,900, might as well continue to hold and hope for the best. What kind of investing are you doing? Short, long-term, personally I'm doing long-term, 10, 15 years, I have a multi-tiered exit strategy. I choose to stick to the plan and expected volatility, thus I will not waver. I purchased the majority of bulk of my back, uh, my bag back in mid 2021. Have continued to accumulate periodically. Whatever your investing style, encourage you to develop a plan with entry and exit points and choose periodic evaluations in order to assess any changes to variables that may cause to augment that plan. Do your best to take the emotion out of it and test the plan uh, against worst and best case scenarios. But only invest what you can afford to lose what does not impact normal uh, operational expenditures. So uh, as you guys can see, very, very interesting. Um, obviously, this is a very, very honest part, post, I'm not gonna lie. Um, and I do appreciate uh, the honesty. Uh, I also wanted to say that, look, if you're invested and at some point you saw your money peak, and then it drops um, and knowing the type of potential uh, that SHIB has, uh, that other you know tokens as well, well, anything within the SHIB ecosystem has, uh, perhaps it is best to wait. You know, at the end of the day, it's your decision, but think about it. The big developments are about to come out. We've got Shibarium on its way. Uh, we've got, you know, exchanges like uh, the massive exchanges also listing Bone. Um, and uh, I know this person is holding SHIB, but if Bone gets listed, Leash, uh, the whole SHIB ecosystem will go up, okay? That's more exposure, more investors. Um, also, uh, the developers are trying to diversify their strategies. They're trying to go into fast food, trying to go into clothing, into anything they can really find, because something will eventually pop. And when it pops, when it does well, uh, we will be there, we will be making the big bucks, and uh, hopefully, you know, they they will reinvest a lot of the money that they make out of it, and that will increase, you know, the demand. They're gonna be reinvesting money in order to make it even bigger and bigger and really catch the eye of a lot of uh, other investors. So big, big projects are coming, and I think it would be, you know, extremely uh, sad and uh, just a complete waste if you had, uh, told me right now that you're just gonna sell and uh, for you know just for a couple of bucks unless you really need that money believe me if you need that money you shouldn't have even invested in the first place this is the money that you can afford to lose that you can afford to forget about never invest money that you can't do it that you really need that's a very very bad investment strategy invest uh, like i've said money that you can really like kind of just forget that it even exists check your accounts in a few years and then see the massive growth or worst case scenario you don't see anything but at the end of the day you haven't invested that much money i don't know how much that person makes what their wealth is 
but you know by standard metrics for an investment it's not that much but the type of returns that you could see are absolutely insane um, you know if you had invested three thousand uh, dollars last year at the peak when SHIB you know peaked uh, that would have been converted into hundreds of thousands of dollars if not millions of dollars so a lot of money would have been made and this is why um, you know a lot of people are so excited about cryptos because genuinely miracles can happen uh, the growth that can happen is absolutely as absolute crazy extraordinary you might never even see percentages like that if you had invested in stocks perhaps you know it could be less risky uh, but I don't think you'd see such massive returns as with cryptos uh, cryptos are also very unpredictable that's why people don't really put in that much money but having said that all there do exist whales and some whales have millions of dollars uh, invested into it and if whales are putting in so much money these are experts these are you know the top top boys the top dogs in the market they know what they're doing so you want to be up there with them you want to be following uh, their steps their movements because they don't just invest millions of dollars for nothing there's always a reason behind it so uh, if you are you know invested in SHIB ecosystem hopefully it's a long-term plan hopefully you've got a figure in your mind uh, relax forget about your money if you don't really need it that much but if you do then withdraw it but really decide don't let, let panic don't let, let uh, any emotions or the fact that you've been waiting really get into your head and uh, make you take decisions that you don't want to take so as of now I just want to say uh, that guys you should be uh, joining this community so make sure you're subscribed make sure you hit that notifications bell uh, be part of the community is a growing community it needs you you need us and also comment down below in the comment section what are you thinking I mean is this person right to hold or should the person just uh, sell it at $600 and just leave it so what do you think this person this investor should do uh, leave it down below in the comment section let's open it up uh, let's open up an engagement and uh, guys I just want to say a big thank you to everyone I appreciate all the support and I'll see you in my next video peace out